Hey Ross World, my money makes money. Bitcoin, cryptocurrencies, blockchains, and electronic ledgers. What is it all about? Now, Dr. Boyce Watkins, which I'm not a spokesperson for, or nor do I work for him, no connection at all, is having a seminar on his channel, and I believe it's through Your Black World or Dr. Boyce Watkins' channel that you can get more information about it. But here's my thing. I bought a little bit of Bitcoin, not a lot at all. We're talking about $25 worth, but Bitcoin stock price or the currency rate or however, I don't know that much about it. So I'm trying to send you the information so you know where to go look for it. Well, Bitcoin started out in 2010 or 2011. It was only worth like a dollar. Now it's worth over $10,000 and it's dwindling between 9,000 and 10,000. But if you would have bought some, it would have been well. If you would have if you would have bought a thousand dollars worth of Bitcoin when it first came out, it would be worth it would be worth somewhere over a hundred million dollars. Now, don't think that you need ten thousand dollars in order to buy into Bitcoin because just like Acorns or something like that, you can buy into Bitcoin and have fractional shares, a fraction of a share. Now, if Bitcoin continues to go up. That fraction of a share for whatever the price you pay for it could quadruple, so on and so forth. So is Bitcoin a good buy? Now, all the financial gurus are talking about it. Uh, Bill Gates, Warren Buffett, uh, Mark Cuban, all the big boys in the game, billionaires are talking about Bitcoin. And now Dr. Boyce Watkins are talking about it. And I follow his channel. He has some great information. So I have some Bitcoin, and I also have some Litcoin or Litecoin, the one that the Google developer made that has two types of technologies. Now, in order to understand what I'm talking about, you have to research Bitcoin. I believe that you should, okay, you should put a little money in Bitcoin just in case. Now, just in case this thing takes off and it becomes the universal currency, which I think it is. And see, that is the issue. Is this the new currency that's universal? Or is it just another gimmick? Because now that you're getting a grasp of the US currency and world currency and world trade and investing, here comes Bitcoin. You're like, oh my God, now I gotta learn this too. Now, if you wanna survive in the game and have a wealthy retirement, you should learn about this. Because if it does take off, you can be kicking yourself in the ass. And if it doesn't, then you'll be like, uh, well, I wasted a hundred bucks, I wasted 200 bucks, but nevertheless, you gave it a try. Is it worth that amount of money? I believe that it is. I believe that it is. So there's all this information around the web and also on YouTube. I believe that you should educate yourself up as I'm educated now, Quite some time ago, early in this year, I did get information, I did the research, and I put out a video about Bitcoin and everything that it entails. So you can go search for that on my channel, but also there's other entities and other channels that will probably give you more accurate and more detailed information. So, is Bitcoin worth your money? Hey, throw $50 into it. You was gonna blow it at the liquor store. Throw. $75 into it, you're gonna blow it a night at the club. Throw $100 into it, you're gonna buy somebody you don't even care about a Christmas gift, okay? So go ahead, do your research, and invest. And if it pans out, thank me. If it doesn't pan out, uh, no comment. This is Ross World, my money makes money. I'm out.